guess it's time to start, huh? I was just sitting here enjoying some Skittles from Halloween because no, not a single child came to our house on Halloween. So, um, we've just been consuming all the candy. And S Skittles are the only non-chocolate thing that I like. I know I said, uh, in my Halloween video, I was like, no chocolate, no dice. I actually kind of enjoy Skittles. I don't know why. I think a lot of it is, is the texture. Yeah, you had one trick-or-treater. Kids don't trick-or-treat anymore. I think they're scared of the world, or their parents are scared of the world for them. Um, I think I like Skittles in the same way that I like a fruit roll-up. Because it, like, it has to be the texture, right? Because I don't really care about the taste of hard candy. I think it's the texture. It's the same way, like, a fruit roll-up, you, like, roll it all up into a ball and chew on it. I think there's something about that. <laughs> I think there's something about that that's good. Um, I'm gonna replay Shadow of the Tomb Raider because that video I just posted today, there were just bits of it that were making me think of Tomb Raider and I was like, I would rather play Tomb Raider. And so now I wanna play Tomb Raider. I've, I've put a lot of hours into this one. This is the best of the of the new ones for sure, because they just get progressively better. Tomb Raider 2013 had all the same problems as this, um, as Horizon Zero Dawn, as far as like it just being a generic ass action game. I only got through the whole thing because I'm just a simp for Tomb Raider and I'll play everything they put out. Um, but they really get better and better over the course of the new ones. Sorry, this is just my like Skittles eating rant. You can deal with it. And this one is actually good. <laughs> I'm talking about a whole series of three games that took me like 40 hours each, and I'm like, the last one is good. <laughs> Guys, after 80 hours, I've started to enjoy myself with this series. They really do, they, but they get more and more Tomb Raider-like is what I'm trying to say. This song is giving circus. We have to skip that song. It's giving circus too much. Um, because my favorite Tomb Raiders are the like the two thousands remakes. So like Anniversary, Legend, and Underworld. Those are the ones that are like those are the OGs to me because I didn't play the old old ones. Um. This one is the most Tomb Raider-like of the new ones, is what I'm saying, as far as, like, there's actually puzzles and stuff in it. Oh, th <laughs> you think the Tomb Raider, the movie in 2018, was not bad? Did you watch it, or are you seeing reviews? I don't even remember what the reviews were. It was fine, but it was absolutely nothing special. The Angelina Jolie one is okay. And then I think I tried to watch the second Angelina Jolie one and I was like, this is not okay. This is not okay with me. How many tombs do you raid in it is actually a good question, okay? Because that's- <laughs> I think that's how I've described this game before. Is that like, the first one, there's not that many tombs. And this one, there's a lot of tombs. So you literally can rate them in terms of number of tombs. There's a lot more tombs in this one, which makes it better. Um, the girl that played Lara in the 2018 one, I don't know what, what her name is. She was fine, I have nothing against her. But she didn't look like Lara Croft. She looked like an Instagram model, which is fine. Again, she's very beautiful. Um, but she just, she just has a very young face and a face that looks like it has been through no bullshit. And Lara Croft's been through a lot of bullshit. You know, so she needs to look a little bit hardened. Um. Anyway, so, as I finish my Skittles, kind of important announcements is very exciting. 
Um, there's lots happening right now in terms of things that are exciting for me and not you that much. But I think this is my first stream where I have memberships, which are basically like Twitch subs, right? You get emotes and everything. Um, so if you want to give me $5 a month, like you're welcome to do that now. I know all of you have been like clamoring to give me $5 a month. They're like, please, when can we give you $5 a month? The time is now. <laughs> Your time is now. Um, and then there's merch now too. Merch slash t-shirts in general. This is one of them. I didn't even actually wear this in order to say that, I swear I didn't. <laughs> um, but you can buy this shirt now on my little website that I made. I've been putting a lot of effort into it for a long time. That's the main reason why I haven't been streaming is because I've been working on this website and like setting up the business. Okay, I started a business, you guys. I had to list myself as CEO. <laughs> oh my god, see membership. Thank you so much for the membership, Squinky. I'm assuming that's how I pronounce it. This is my problem now is I'm going to have to start trying to pronounce people's names. I'm gonna have to just give up. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I had to I had to submit a government form, you guys, and put what my title was in the company, and I said CEO, baby. I'm the CEO. So, absolutely, I'm a businesswoman. Um, I'm coming for Kylie Jenner's uh whole shtick, right? I'm coming for Kylie Jenner. Um, I'm coming for Kim Kardashian. I am the next billionaire businesswoman for selling print-on-demand t-shirts online. Okay, can I start the game? I'm trying to. I'm trying to like chew and swallow my skittles real quick. <laughs> you guys, give me a second to chew and swallow my skittles. Um, my controller keeps disconnecting. See, I was thinking about just putting the menu music on in the background because it's very, it's very creepy, right? Because this is, it's Tomb Raider, it's creepy. And so, um, oh, I think you can't, you can't join a membership from mobile, I'm sorry. I don't know. I don't know if you can during a stream. It seems like you should be able to during a stream, but I don't, normally you can't. So I'm sure they're going to add that eventually. Because uh, it is annoying, because a lot of people are on mobile. I know like there's a lot of people that only use YouTube on mobile, so... YouTube will figure their shit out eventually, but for now you just can't. Um... Okay. What was I saying? Oh, there's just- there's just- uh, prepare yourself for a huge mood shift. Because I know this music that has been playing is very nice and chill. And we're about to go into scary, spooky, tomb raiding mode. So, um, just get ready. There's another lovely song playing that we're gonna stop because we're going. We're it's scary now. It's scary and spooky, and scary now. I'm very excited to play this again because this is my favorite one. I said I love Tomb Raider. This isn't my favorite Tomb Raider period. My favorite Tomb Raider period is uh, Underworld. Um, but this is my favorite of the new ones. Okay, we're gonna go new game. We're gonna overwrite everything. We're gonna start over. We're gonna start completely over. Oh, I can choose difficulty? Um, okay. Let me get my light situation worked out. I have such a... It's such a dilemma with lights for me because I want you guys to be able to see me, but I also don't want a glaring bright white light in my face the whole time. But it looks so much better. I'm also like so anal about how it looks, so it looks better when it's on. Somebody said this was copying Uncharted. <laughs> Uncharted literally is Tomb Raider. Also, can we talk about this? horrifying bloody cat face that's looking at us right now that's terrifying okay what what's the normal 
I just want normal difficulty, okay? I'm not really a gamer. I don't really want it to be hard. Um, oh, but okay. No, this is what I love about this one. Is that there's different difficulties for the combat and the exploration and stuff. So we'll do... We'll start it on normal and then we're gonna make... Um, we're gonna make exploration and puzzles hard. Like, I love that that was such a brilliant idea. I love that, because this is gonna make it so that, um... There's not the, the white paint on everything telling us what we can grab. And the puzzles will be harder. Yay! I love this game! I'm so excited to play this again. I don't think I've completely started it over before. Because there was a lot of DLC and stuff, so I've put a lot of hours into it with like the DLC, but I haven't just completely started it over. <sighs> Is this like... Do I hit A here? Oh, that... I'm sorry. I was supposed to hit A there. The white paint is patronizing, but also, like, they kind of need it sometimes. From what I remember, this game does a better job with that than, uh, than a lot of them. But it's, it's kind of necessary when you get realistic, like I was saying in today's video, like, you know, it's just, it's hard to make things clear if they're also, like, 4K HD textures on everything. Anyway, shut up. It's a cutscene. My controller is vibrating with the heartbeat, just so you know. This bitch is always in a plane crash. Like, if you just looked up on any random Tuesday what was happening uh, with Lara Croft, like, she's probably in a plane crash. My controller is vibrating so much. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye to him. The seatbelt, like, is that really going to save you? You're in half of a plane, girl. You're in half of a plane. You're putting the seatbelt on? Jonah, you there? That's kind of the same thing that, uh... They just did... Uh, that YouTube videos do, including mine, right? Where you put the exciting part at the beginning and then you actually start it. So you, like, keep people watching. Except it's kind of unnecessary in a game. Because just so you know, we're going to see that exact cutscene again in a minute. Obviously. Just a little stuck. A rock pin my leg. This is so terrifying and claustrophobic. It is wild because you already bought the game. That's what I'm saying. It's so unnecessary. I don't know why they wanted to give us a heart attack right in the beginning. I love Tomb Raider. I love Tomb Raider. <laughs> it's just... Uh. Okay, this is gross, obviously. Ah. But, like, I appreciate... This is gonna sound weird. But I appreciate how, like, realistically in pain she is. You know, she's not like these... She's not like these male action stars that are just, like, taking all these hits like it's nothing and acting normal. Like, she reacts like a normal person would, and I find that very relatable, and somehow that makes the games better to me. Yeah. 
Like, yeah, she's in a lot of pain, but it's like, that's what would happen, though. Like, that's how it would feel. I remember thinking that about the first... Oh, this is me now. This is me holding up. This is a me holding up moment. I remember feeling like that about Tomb Raider 2013. Even though, like I said, the gameplay wasn't very Tomb Raider. In the cutscenes, like, when she gets hurt, she gets hurt. And it's like, that's how you would fucking scream if you got hurt like that. It's just much more relatable to me than a lot of games are, I guess. And I like that she, like... She's in pain and she reacts like she's in pain, but she's also a badass because she keeps going anyway. I'm gonna talk about this forever. <laughs> But that's like a whole life lesson, right? Is that like, shit is hard and you keep going anyway. And it doesn't make it less hard. Like you just get used to it and the more you get through it, the more confidence you have in the future that you'll be able to get through it. So it doesn't get less hard, but you get stronger. Maybe I'll turn it down a little bit. So I don't want you guys to be hearing that through the mic and the speakers. Okay. I always go backwards first, you know. Uh, lots of lots of piles of poo poo around here. Lots of sticks. Lots of piles of poo poo. That's you know classic Tomb Raider situation. Jonah, I'm out. Be careful. The way into the site is full of traps. Trinity's not done with it yet. They're protecting something. Six weeks, and still no salt beans on who's leaving the local Trinity cellar. But I talked to some people in town, and they're excited. There's a VIP coming to the Day of the Dead. Name's Dominguez, we should look into it. Like, she's so cool. <laughs> I wish I was Lara. I say that all the time. I wish I was Lara Croft. This is no way I can do this shit. Climbing on overhangs like this is so hard, and this is full horizontal, dude. I took a rock climbing class in high school, and I couldn't even do like a 45 degree angle, let alone whatever the fuck this is. There's no way. Yes, queen. I keep looking around like there's going to be secrets, but this is not a part of the game where there's going to be secrets. I'm on my way in. Almost there. Sorry, I didn't wait. Be careful. Like, how fucking cool is this image? Like, coming across this in real life would feel so crazy. It's huge. Um, so is that the sun coming through there? Is that outside? Big giant skull man is pointing his big giant skull man laser um, at this enormous crystal. If you don't know the story of the other games, it's not that important. But we're just basically always racing Trinity, which Trinity is the evil, the evil guys organization. We're just always racing them to steal some artifact, you know? And we're like mad that they're stealing artifacts, but also we're stealing artifacts too, so... I don't really know who the bad guy is supposed to be. Wow. Get a load of this place. Guess all that research paid off. Now we know what Trinity is after. Yeah, they really didn't want us in here. I'm glad we followed your father's notes. Guys, I'm cold, but my cat is laying on top of the blanket. What am I supposed to do about this? I'm like shivering. I saw where the passage collapsed on you back there. You want me to take a look? <laughs> no, I'm fine. What is all this? Constellations. This the thing is, Lara's Lara's stealing artifacts Kingfish. slash just looking at them. She does a lot of just looking at them too. But she's doing it for educational purposes. Okay, she just wants the world to know about them. And Trinity's doing it for like world takeover purposes. Looks like it was 
damaged, perhaps intentionally. Why would Trinity sabotage this? They usually just destroy everything. No, I think the damage is older. But who would have tampered with it? Oh! Laura! Oopsie! You gotta get her. <laughs> the pictures? The pictures with my with my cool pics? With my little digital cool pics camera? Move! Move! Hurry! Move, bitch. It's so convenient how in, in movies and games when a tunnel is collapsing, it collapses like from the back to the front. <laughs> Isn't that so funny? What what would necessitate it collapsing from the back to the front? Like from from the back to the exit so that you can just it, exactly run away from where it's currently collapsing. It's just going to collapse randomly. really good food. I know the chef. I'm not very hungry. After all of that, I'm starving. Anyway, we got our pictures. Now we're just gonna go hang out, I guess. Have a nice little break. There he is. Anything new on Dr. Dominguez? Not much. He's leading a few Trinity digs in the area. My father mentioned him in his journal more than once. He's an expert on pre-colonial ruins. Everyone says he's a great guy. Big help to the town. So how's your leg? I'm so happy to be playing Tomb Raider again. I feel like I missed Lara, like as if she's a real person that I know. <laughs> it's directions. To find the hidden city, go south along the shore until you find the pink fish. I, I found something for that. It's pink dolphins. Lara looking at a row of four emojis. Then chase the heart. Their the directions. We're going north and northwest and southwest and, and west. Look at this. 50 miles and, and 25 miles. While she's looking at a row of four emojis. This star is the heart. It's set in the southwest. So southwest from the Amazon River. Brazil. Peru. Peru? Okay. Um, this date from the ruin see if you look closely it is damaged this number looks like a maya 13 but what if it's really an eight with procession it what uh procession the uh, she's so smart over time these stars appear in a different place on the horizon important if you're not look at my wife star. she's so smart in the maya calendar that's a two thousand year difference back then the heart of the serpent set directly to the west so, that's why it's in Peru, not Brazil. Trinity has been looking in the wrong place. Exactly. We need to the look outfits for are the Silver Crown Mountain in Peru. There's more. Uh, something they look so comfy. Key. What is Trinity looking for in the hidden city? Doctor, we found him. Yes. Show me. The way the Trinity guys are just talking, like, so loudly and openly about their evil deeds <laughs> in the middle of this town square. Oh my god, I look so badass right now. <gasps> look at me slaying right now. Trinity's people are armed. I heard they brought in reinforcements. I'll stay out of their way. I want to avoid what happened with the last cell we took down. I'm so excited Maybe they're making another the one. Site. They're rebooting so it again. Which, I don't know Maybe why that's necessary, it. but... I'm always happy Game for more far. Tomb Raider, because I thought they might so. not make any more for a long yeah. time. But they're apparently working on another one right now. Someone must know something. Yes, How's it going? Yes, Da, 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 da. Oh my god, ice cream? This party is popping though. What's up, child? Look, for my father. 
Maybe I can light one for my mother. Look, for my father! As he stabs it into my eye. I'm not really used to crowds. You'd rather storm guards, or the devils. <laughs> Dude, she doesn't like crowds? Me. Jonah, he's at the gate. I can't get over how badass I look. I wish I could go through the whole game like this. This should be a skin that I can wear. I was just saying I like I like Angelina Jolie uh, Tomb Raider. I'm into it. I'll take care of these guys. Hey fellas, how you doing? Good. You can't come. I heard there was some kind of a crazy guest, like chicks and skull makeup. Jonah's a homie. Oh my god, they're talking about their evil deeds over there now. Look at me with my little backpack with my pickaxe and my carabiners. Ready for anything. Ready to slay in any environment. Jonah, I'm in. Good. Those guards were not is my leg still fucked up? Do I still have a bandage on? I have pants over it anyway. Excuse me. But like my leg was very fucked up. I feel like I'd be limping. I feel like I'd be limping a little bit. Um, do we care about extra stuff? I don't think so, right? Cause I could walk around everywhere. It's not like there'd be very much here anyway. This is my maximum speed, by the way. I'm sure you can tell because it's kind of a cutscene, but I can't go any faster than this. Oh, why did I think this was the way? I'm walking into nothing. I need to go that way. Right? Can I get through here? Guys, where am I going? This is a maze. <laughs> I'm stuck in a maze. I'm stuck in a maze and the people are walls. Jonah, Dominguez is not just the leader of the cell. I think he's the leader of Trinity. We need to be careful. What's the point of having a secret earpiece yeah, yeah, if every you. time I use the secret earpiece, I'm doing this? I'm going, Jonah, Jonah, can you hear me on the secret earpiece? With my hand up to my ear and my head down. Are archaeologists process. competing like this in real life? What's wrong? I want confirmation. Oh my god, archaeology is just a big race. I'll make sure we get visual. Whoa, look at that giant skeleton dancing! I don't remember that. Jonah, they might have noticed me. I'll try to it's like a big me. puppet. That's so cool. That's sick. I don't think I ever noticed that. I can't go through here, right? I'm going this way. This is a very cool environment that they've made for this part. Dominguez wants confirmation Croft is here. Again, so convenient that these guys are talking about their evil deeds right next to this wall that I can listen over. It's very cool for me. I'm getting the freaking scoop on the evil deeds right now. Hi. Get out of my office. Sorry. Close the door when you leave. Right. His office. As he sits on trash bags. Ah! Lo siento! <laughs> Don't 
Don't worry. Go. Play. Oh my god, maybe Please Trinity's nice. Sorry, They're helping a child. Or at least they didn't, like, kick the child to death. Which is the same thing. I'm not paying that much attention to what they're saying because I've played this before. Now, do I remember what they're talking about? No, Jonah, but I just, I, I know at some point I knew. I'll find another way in. So it's probably fine. This guy can see me though, right? <laughs> this guy would be able to see me up there. Oh, I gotta remember the controls, guys. Please be patient with me. Oh my god, I'm going- I'm going extra badass mode now. I'm getting all my shit out. Ugh. There's got to be more to these rumors. It's funny that like in the first game I used a bow and arrow because I was like literally on an island with nothing. And had to make something. Like I had to make a weapon. And now I could use guns, but maybe she's just attached to the bow at this point. Okay. Oh, now we're talking. I got 25 arrows. Oh, I missed this. Can I put my brightness up a little bit, you guys? It's so dark. <laughs> it's so dark. Is this cheating? I don't care. First of all, we're putting this on highest, okay? Because I have a new gaming PC I need to uh, brag about to all of you. Um... Is brightness over here? Brightness is over here. Listen. <laughs> I put this shit all the way up. It's so much easier. I'm squinting. Okay, I don't want to squint. Look how much better that is. And it's still, it's still giving the darkness vibes. It's just that I can see now. I think they're killing somebody. Guys, I think they're killing somebody. Okay, that guy's not looking right. I can get this guy. Ooh! Knife through the back. Not anymore, Mr. Lead Archaeologist. Your employment has been terminated. Please, no. I have money. I can pay you. Fuck you, guy. I feel like there was somewhere behind me I could go. No, but it's also just kind of leading me through this right now. What did they find? Well, they've been searching for a temple. Girl, you got so much hair in your face. Today they found it. I have to go warn my sister. Her hair She's looks so much now. better in this one than 2013, though. Tomb Raider 2013, Lara's hair was crazy. Jonah, Trinity just tried to kill a local archaeologist. I'm going back because I thought there was something over here. And I might be wrong. And I might be wasting time. Up here. Yeah, right? This is Commander Rourke. All teams, get ready for Operation Black. Just kidding. Maybe that was the original path that I just went around. Okay. Resources. Obtained. I'm hearing beeping. I think there's little, um... There's like geocaches and stuff you can pick up that are extra. Oh, but that beeping might just be <laughs> woodland animals. <laughs> I might just be talking about the jungle animals. But there are geocaches you can pick up that make little beeping sounds. And also, um... Have little lights on the ground. For just a little- just a little extra... Secret thing for fun, you know. 
Am I just running through this place, or is there something... Here. See, like, that's a... Mechanical beeping, right? Oh, there? No, that's a plant. That's what we in the industry call plant. I don't know, what is that sound? If I miss it, I miss it, okay. Like I said, I've played this before, we don't need to get everything. beyond her gaze. Key. This is it. This looks just like a part in Underworld. Got to make my way down. That looks just like this place you're climbing all over in Underworld. Underworld is so good. I'm never gonna have time to play all the Tomb Raiders for the channel, but I would. I would if I could. Underworld, you get to go underwater? Maybe that's the underworld they're talking about. Okay, this is work. A little under the sea action, okay. Again, I keep looking around. There's not gonna be secret stuff here. This is basically an extended cutscene. This is Commander Rourke. I want the site secured ASAP. When Dr. Dominguez arrives, we all go in together. I have a lot of freaking rope, too. Let me tell you, this girl carries around a lot of freaking rope. Whoa, calm down. Step back. Retreat from that situation. Whoop. Slay. See, there's little, like, quick time things. Um. Where they make you grab the wall again after you grabbed it. But I'm so used to the quick time events that I just push X a million times every time I jump anyway. So I like never have to worry about it. The quick time doesn't add anything for me because I'm already jumping and pressing X 50 times. As a preventative measure. I do the preventative measure for, for the quick time events. Am I going down? Yeah, 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 I'm going down and I'm swinging. Look at all these barnacles! Oh my god! Look at all- look at those barnacles raining down when I run on this wall! Barnacles are one of the classes of animals that freak me out, personally. I'm a little bit freaked out by barnacles in the same way that I'm freaked out by mushrooms. They just don't seem quite right to me. Um, oh, now I'm doing- now I'm dropping and swinging. Now I'm dropping and swinging this way. Whoop! This is it. Slay. Oh my god, I slayed. Jonah, I, I slayed all of that. We may lose contact. Something's just fallen in the kitchen. I'm shimmying myself through slimy little holes again. This cave looks like it's usually underwater. Does it? Look at all these freaking skulls. There are always more skulls in these caves than could- could be possible for a civilization. Like, the density of skulls is truly outrageous. Skull density is off the charts in here. Oh, 
Oh yeah, this is how we learn different languages. Um, is by simply looking at them. <laughs> and this one, um... So like, this one is Maya? This mural depicts some kind of voyage or pilgrimage undertaken by the Maya. Seems they carried an item of great import and traveled south to the source of the pink fish. The Amazon River, just like Jonah said. I always read all of these and look at all the artifacts and look at all the details. Okay, because I'm like that in museums too. I read all the plaques about everything. Um, but so there's different... There's a bunch of different ancient cultures in the same region that we're in. Like there's Maya and Aztec, I think, and another one. Um... So all of them have their own, like, different storylines with their own gods and stuff, which is cool, but it's hard for my stupid brain to keep track of. Oh, so maybe that one I can't read. So yeah, by looking at those murals I can, like, learn the languages better and then, um, be able to read other things. Again, this is a... Yet another absolutely superb what? explanation of video gaming by me. This is still a lot of tutorial stuff. Ah! Ratatouille! Make me spaghetti. What is this? Holding cells. Holding cells. Like, this is so fucking cool looking. Look at all those bats. I'm like actually cold and I kind of want to steal the blanket from the cat, guys. I'm, ki I'm kind of feeling like I need to steal the blanket from the cat. She's like freaking out about the bat noises. <laughs> she's like looking around. No, this is my chance because now she's awake. Oh, well, I'm, I'm moving her. It's fine. Just, what are you freaked out about? The bat noises are really freaking my cat out, guys. She's losing it. She's like looking all around the room like she thinks they're in here. Also, the controller- <laughs> the controller is drifting. The controller is drifting like crazy and you'll have to deal with it. Am I gonna swim? Is that what's happening? Ha! Can I get up here? No. Oh gee, she's immersed! <laughs> exactly, the cat is immersed as fuck right now. Oh, see this little blinking light? This is a little geocache thing. Is it beeping? I'm not hearing a beep from this one. No, I don't even remember if they beep. Just making sure I'm not missing anything. I'm pretty sure I'm just supposed to jump in the water. Okay. Let's get under this water, huh? Let's get under this freaking water. And look around a little bit. Let's have a little adventure under the sea real quick. finding shit. Look at me discovering things. Dude, there's some freaking uh, piranhas in this game that are scary. The piranhas will fuck you up. Like, if you see them, you need to leave. Here's another extra thing. <laughs> Her digging underwater. Where 
Where am I going? Okay. This is the way we're actually going, I think. Oh, and I can like sprint swim, of course, because that's always a thing in games. I wonder if that makes me run out of breath faster, I don't know. Whoa! That was one of Ursula's eels. Oh, and there's bones in here? This is nasty. I'm getting all kinds of diseases from this water right now, for sure. There's diseases in this water that haven't even been seen for thousands of years. Oh my god. <laughs> that actually jump scared me. Girl. I didn't even really have to fight it off, though. Oh my god, now I'm drowning. Get it together. I didn't even really have to fight the eel off. It just kind of, like, wrapped around me a little bit and gave me a little hug, and I was like, Ew, go away! And it went away. I said, Ew, go away! It said, oh, fine, sorry. Sorry, Lara's dying. I should be more concerned, I guess. Girl, wiggle! Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Wiggle and jiggle. You better get through that hole. Oh my god. Um, I have to find okay, a sorry, to there's people school. asking questions. Um, the sweatshirts are normally sized, I don't know. <laughs> Everything is like regular, like, t-shirt sizes. Um, I wouldn't really know because I get everything big on purpose, so like, I got a large in the sweatshirt because I like a huge sweatshirt. But I would say they run normal, if I had to say. And I'm probably not gonna play Hogwarts Legacy. Okay? Because JK Rowling has been destroying her legacy, if you know what I mean. And it's really, it's really put a damper on my interest in the series. Unfortunately. Okay, I finally have a map. I finally have a map. All of this stuff is where most of the game is, but we're in kind of a different place right now. A gun. Wonderful explanations of everything. We're in kind of a different place right now, but then but there's like this other place, but we're in this place right now. And it does have like extra stuff on the map, which is nice. It looks like there oh there were two relics back there. Hold on. Hold on. Back where? Back where I can't get now? Okay, so I could go back through the actual hallway if I had that knife. Where the fuck were those- I- I need to look harder. I need to use my eyeballs more. I can't believe I missed two things. I guess we continue. This is another thing I'm gonna... That was very close to my head. That was outrageously close to my head. Oh my god, Noah's answering questions in the chat. If you guys have questions about the, the store, Noah is doing customer service right now. <laughs> um... That is a pit I don't want to fall into, I'm guessing. Oh my god. I'm finna be in the pit. <laughs> Did any of you guys see that TikTok? I'm finna be in the pit. Jonah, I made it. I'm in an underground temple. Whoa. 
not good. Laura, Trinity's blasting their way in. I can tell. It's causing tremors. There's a pyramid. I'm gonna get to the top. I seriously... Like, I'm biased towards these games because I love Tomb Raider. But... You know, comparing this to Horizon Zero Dawn... I feel like this is the correct way to do the realistic new video games. Because these graphics are obviously like realistic style, but the way that they do the lighting and everything is still it's just it's just so much better. They're they're differentiating things with like lighting and like the textures will be very different, like like this bell and the and the rocks, right? But I don't know, it's just very tastefully done, so that things are, like, just noticeable enough. And they also don't put a billion particles in the air. There's no reason you need to have a billion particles in the air like you're- like you're- everything is pollinating. And you can't see anything. But again, I'm- t I'm totally biased, and- and, you know, there's many things about this game that are still- just average triple-A modern action game. I'm not denying that. But I do feel like it's better. You know, for what it is. Oh my god, this guy is not having a good day. This guy is having a bad day. Yes, she's British. <laughs> yes, Lara Croft is British. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at this guy. Low-key, his back is probably hella stretched out, though. Low-key, his vertebrates are, ha have so much room right now between them. Are there more? Are there more? Oh my god, there's more bodies behind him. Whoa, look at all these people. What happened to them, huh? Good. There are platforms that can help me reach the top. Looking for something to weigh them down. You're breaking up. Got some activity here. I'm gonna get closer. Where was the document? Why am I missing so much stuff? That's gotta be above me, right? No, that's above me. So... I mean, I can go that way. Maybe there's something extra over here? What is this? Oh my god, pick it up. Please. So what is for arrows? What else is over here? Just stuff? Just stuff for fun? Oh, this is a cart I can push. What's up here? I'll need to find a way to get to the other side. How did the Lara get to the other side? I've got to find a way. That sounded like Hermione. How do I do Lara's accent? What? It, what's the difference? When I try to do a British accent, I only sound like Hermione. So now that one's higher, and now I can get to it from up here. Anyway, but that's something Lara says a lot, is I've got to find a way, because she's got to find a way. It is true. I can't- can I jump all the way to that one? That's scary. Whoa! <gasps> Why am I so surprised that stuff is going wrong? Okay, was the document in here? Yeah. Where is that? 
A secondary party, a few days behind the main pilgrimage, reported strange things on the route. The beasts had become more ferocious, and the jungle itself more dangerous. The trees and vines gnarled and twisted, growing thorns as long as a man's finger and sharp as blades. Thorns as long as a man's finger. She has a very different British accent, I think, than, I'm, than I usually do. <laughs> not that I'm good at it, because I'm not. But hers is very different. Um, the death cutscenes are pretty bad. Yeah, there's there's a lot of brutal deaths. Like I was saying earlier, I kind of love Lara's pain. There's something about Lara's pain that's very exciting to me. <laughs> um, okay. I'm so bad at noticing things. I need to pay attention. Those worthy shall be sacrificed to the red goddess. She of the waning moon and she of the waxing moon. Grandmother to all. Life taker and birth giver. Oh my- Lara, please! I- You guys saw me push the button and it didn't do the right thing. <laughs> I pushed the button and it did like a melee attack instead of just cutting the rope. That was not my- It did it again! <laughs> you guys! It's the same button! <laughs> it did it again! Slow down! Slow down, slow down, slow down. Walk, girl. <laughs> Slowly. Oh my god. I don't like how far I lean down when I cut it either, because the- the- Blades always come, like, right in front of my face. <laughs> um... Okay. Again, I'm, like, trying to look around and make sure I don't miss things. But there's nothing more on the map. So I think we're okay. The thing about this one, too, is, like, when I'm getting these artifacts... Whoa, am I jumping? Maybe that would have been bad if I didn't jump. Could I have got up there? Ugh. Anyway. Something they changed in this one is that, um... You have to push a button to actually read the stuff when you're looking at an artifact. Like, it used to just take you to read it, and now you have to push a button. And so I always push the button because I, I like to read the things. But I guess that's nice if you if you if you want to be stupid and not care. If you want to be ignorant to these to these Mayan legends we're learning about. Okay, so this is like a little like railroad transfer situation, I think. This is like uh in Thomas Thomas the Tank Engine. When they go to that big circle thing that spins and puts them on different tracks, I think that's what's going on. This... I think just turns it. This will turn this. Because what am I trying to do? Get it to bust through this? I think I want to free up- Lara, please do not jump off the cliff, I swear to god. Um, I think I want to bash through this to free up this bell, so it'll start swinging. So I need to pull this cart up to the top, so I need to turn it around. Just wait, just wait, my genius is showing. My genius is showing so much right now. I need to turn this around this way. A little bit more, like that. Cut this. Shoot it in that instead. And now I can use the crank. Pull the cart up the hill. 
and then I'm gonna let it go cowabunga dude is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go cowabunga mode in a second is what I'm gonna do. I'm about to cause another cave-in is what I'm doing. I'm on my way to causing another cave-in. Okay, I want to get to that ladder, I think. Can I just do that? Can I just go ahead and do that? If I'm quick with it? If I'm quick with it, I can do it. Am I missing anything? I, see, I appreciate that the map <laughs> has the documents and stuff on it because I'm stupid. And I need that, evidently. Uh... Where am I going from here? Can I jump all the- I can't- Oh, I can hang onto this. It's because I turned the exploration up so I don't- No! Bitch! Something you're gonna notice here is that when I fall, it is 100% of the time Lara's fault and not mine. When I do something smart, it's me. When I fall to my death, it's Lara. That's just how it works. See, I pushed X. My controller must be dying or something. This this can't really be happening to me. You do kind of get used to, like, even without the white paint, you kind of just get used to how things look when you can climb on them. Jonah! Yeah, I'm here. Jonah, there's a mural here. It shows a box. Inscription says, the silver box of Isho. That must be what's in the hidden city. This is a Maya myth. It says the box will summon the god Kukul Khan. Is that what Trinity's after? Wait, there's more. Looks like a series of cataclysms. A tsunami. A storm. An earthquake. Foreshadowing? A so little bit of foreshadowing well, happening? Google Khan is the god of creation and destruction. This looks like the Hydra constellation, but the stars seem out of alignment. Remember when your high school English teacher would be like, see the way this kid uh, picks his nose in the first act is foreshadowing for him getting brain cancer later, and you're like, and the author would probably just be like, no, I just wanted him to pick his nose. Jonah, I found a dagger. There's an inscription. The key to Isha's heart unlocks the cleansing. We can't let Trinity get hold of this. Let's think this through. I've found a very important Laura, dagger. Do I take it? You know I take it. I'm Laura fucking Croft. Oh girl. Oh girl, what have you done? What have I done? <laughs> what have you done? That's what I'm saying. Shit. Jonah, get to higher ground. Oh no, you took it, didn't you? Hurry. You know I took it. You know I'm gonna grab this pot on the way up. Okay. 
God damn, girl. Yes, I heard you, okay? Dominguez is coming tonight. I get it. What I'm telling you is the rain is gonna flood. You're telling me that whole crazy tomb was that weak ass wall away from everything? Okay. Let's make sure everything's copacetic. <laughs> I forgot I can move I can like hide in these vegetated walls. Oh, and I'm like good. invisible. I'm, like completely invisible to people. But you're telling me for like thousands of years that insane tomb was like just you just push these rocks over and you'd be there? Oh my god, I'm muddy as hell. I'm muddy and dirty and muddy as hell. Good thing there's more invisibility walls. What do you think is in there? Ah! I don't know, but I hear the readings are off the Oh, it's charts. right stick to do this. Let's I kept pressing sure left stick thinking that was that was it. Here. Okay. This is my supervision, dude. This is my Google Glass of Tomb Raider. Is this guy looking at anybody? Or he's just chilling by himself? No, nobody cared. Yeah, I think when they're red, it means that somebody's gonna notice if I kill them. Um, first of all, let's pickpocket this man. Um, we'll throw a bottle, sure. It seems to want me to do that. can't build anything that works. How do I drop the bottle? I don't want it. God damn, I don't want the fucking bottle. I didn't know how to put it down. Oh my god. Not them finding me, shit. Ah! I'm in the wall, I'm in the wall. <laughs> Oh my god, that fire is so close to me. Oh my god, girl. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. How do I heal? I don't know any of my controls, you guys. What's my heal button? These are my weapons. Oh, it's... Okay, okay, okay. I'm good. I'm good. We're good. It's fine. I would like you guys to focus more on the uh, sick in-motion headshot that I did on the first guy, uh, rather than the fact that I got discovered immediately. I would like you to focus on that headshot I did. What are they doing? Did they just kill that guy? All right, let's dispose of the bodies. You, monitor the police center. Let us know if the gunshots get reported. Lord, the reinforcements are on the way. Um. I want everything ready when they To the can. wall. To the window. To the wall. Glad to be ready. Yeah, they've been trying to warm out our intentions here for ages. Well, they found out tonight. Hope it was worth it. <laughs> yeah. Assholes should have minded their own business. I wish I had the the double the double shot thing, the Starbucks double shot espresso. I wish I had that. Where's our backup? But there's an ability you can get later. secure, but we still need some cover. There's an ability you can get later where you can shoot two guys at the same time. You like tag them first, and then you can shoot two guys at the exact same time, and it's extremely cool and badass. I feel like I could get him from way further away than I should have been able to. This guy I can easily get in the back of the head, right? Nobody's looking at him. Somebody looking at him? No. Easy. Easy. Beautiful. 
breezy beautiful cover girl is me maybe we go up where he was this seems very bright <laughs> seems very brightly lit up here I feel like this is about to be, um... This is about to be a fucking machine gun part, and I hate those. I'd rather be stealthy. I would rather be stealthy, personally. All these guys are looking at each other. Can I like... Yeah, go over there. Did you see that? Did you see that? I shot- That other guy was about to notice me and I shot him before he could. Shit. It's okay. Yeah, see, now they're gonna make me use the machine gun. I hate this. I don't want to do it. I haven't I haven't been looking at the chat because I have to shoot people, but I'm assuming you're all talking about how great I am. Get out of here with how much health you have! Where's the other guys? Are there guys coming up closer to me? Yes. Why do I care? Just shoot him. My heart is beating. I'm gonna walk closer and there's gonna be more guys. This is scary. I don't like it when I can't be sneaky. I am getting hella swag though. I am obtaining hella swag from them. Wait, 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 wait. No, leave. Leave. There's something over here. <laughs> I really needed that 15 XP out of that box. <sighs> okay. Um, if you can't find a Genshin stream, I might have privated it. Lara Croft. If it was boring, I might have privated it. <laughs> this isn't the way I hope we meet. You know I've been interested in your work. Trinity always is. Oh, that was stressful. I hate- I hate those parts. It does- it kind of makes the game more exciting, but I like being sneaky. And it does, like, it stresses me out to play shooters like that. If you just joined, you missed all these beautiful headshots I just got on these men. I just shot 50 men in the head in a row. It's in a safe place. I'm lying. You don't have it. It was so obvious that I was lying by my face, too. I was like looking everywhere but his eyes. It never occurred to me that you would just stick. Right? He's like amazed at my stupidity. I am too. The world. 
without witness, quote, and certainly with none of this, but without the box, the apocalypse, the death of the sun. You're lying. Lara. Lara, this is what happens when you just you do shit and she don't know what it means. This is the first of many catastrophes you're doing! You would have done the same! I don't think he would have. I think he knows more than you, girl. This part is so sad, because, like, I know she's trying to do the right thing. Do you realize the tragedy you have unleashed? She had no information in the moment, but, like, damn. Girl really fucked up. She fucked up. You're about to see. The cleansing has begun. To me now, to stop it before it confuses us all. Oh, this part makes me cry. Like, this is so crazy, dude. So many people dying right now. my blood on the rock, was it? Oh. This is very depressing. really can get through any lock though. It's really incredible. There's no fucking way I've been swimming for so long. I'm really failing all of the quick time events right now. I'm sorry. Swing on the- oh my god, girl. Swing. On the light. I swear it's her fault. She- she isn't- she's really stressed out right now. I will say she does, she's really stressed out right now. So like, I'll forgive her for that. But I'm just supposed to swing on this, right? Yeah. Climb. 
Climb, climb, climb. Left. Move it. It's so sad. some hard truths right now. Besides, what do we got to go on? A riddle? I get it, though. We're going to need more than paint fish and silver crowns to get to the hidden city. I'm going to help these people. And then we'll find us a plan. Man. Whoops. <laughs> Oops. Started the apocalypse. Sorry about that. Are you ready to see the plane crash again that we saw in the beginning? I think we're looking for a volcanic mountain. The crown of silver is probably a band of clouds. Queen of compartmentalizing her emotions. I just can't get those people back there out of my head. They lost everything. The riddle says, chase the heart of the serpent to the silver crown mountain where the twins can fell. I wonder what the twins are. This storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. It's just a little rain, she says. Two seconds later, they're going to be hurtling toward the ground. If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Jonah's necklace is huge. Got feeling? It's our only clue. The mural says there'll be more disasters. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. 
You mean the tremors of the tsunami? More than that. It felt like I woke something up. I know that it's not practical. I know that it's hard to believe, but you need to trust me. We have to trust each other. Hey, I might have something over here. Really? Oh, that's when I just took my seatbelt off. That's when I just took the seatbelt off just now. I don't like the storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. You're gonna want that back on, girl. Did we get in this plane not knowing where we were going to land? Like, what just happened? What just killed him? A rock? Why are there rocks in the sky? Or is that, is that like hail? What's more likely, rocks in the sky or hail? But what? Oh, it didn't show us the whole thing again. I guess that's convenient. What are the chances that a, a piece of hail that huge would go through the window and right into that guy's eyeball? Like, there's no way I am okay after that. She would be so bruised. Bruised beyond belief. <laughs> Not the monkeys. Her hair's going a little crazy. Her hair's looking a little spaghetti. Her hair's giving spaghetti right now in that position. I'm covered in poo again, unfortunately. Ugh, my girl has had better days. Dr. Pedro Dominguez is an archaeologist and expert in pre-colonial Maya history. <laughs> Look at what my, my controller drift is doing to this. That's the lead Jonah and I were following up on when we came to Cozumel. <laughs> His excavation in Cozumel was one of the last places my father visited before he was killed. Okay, we get it. That's the bad guy. I don't know why I suddenly obtained a photo of him. This is Lara's jungle era. This is Jar Lara's uh, naked and afraid era. You guys ever watch Naked and Afraid? The most exciting part of that show is seeing if they will decide to cuddle for warmth or not. That's always such a dilemma. And I love when there's one that's like, I'm married. I can't, I can't naked cuddle a stranger for warmth. And then they get hypothermia and almost die because of that. Like, why did you go on naked and afraid if you don't want to cuddle naked with a stranger? That's kind of the whole point. <laughs> that happens every time. I'm like, have you seen an episode of the show? I feel like that was so many reality shows. It seems like the people that go on them have never seen an episode of the show. That they're going on. Because if you go on naked and afraid, you will be cuddling naked. It happens every time. I'll keep this for later. Jonah! Can anyone hear me? Girl, you think Jonah's gonna hear Hello? you? Anyone? I would be assuming Jonah was high key dead right now. The vibes that Jonah is giving right now 
are dead. Deceased. I would see that empty chair next to me and go, mm, he's dead. He's gone. Look at me collecting lovely little flowers in this forest. Do I have a map? The answer is yes. No shit, girl. Um, but I feel the same way about um, Project Runway. Because that's the other reality show. Well, I, I, never mind. I don't watch Naked and Afraid. That makes it sound like I watch Naked and Afraid. I don't. The Silver Crown Mountain. But the one like reality the competition Mountain. show that I like is Project Runway. And there's so many instances of that where I feel like people going on the show have never fucking seen the show. Because the a challenge will come up and they'll be like, I never expected this! And I'm like, they do this challenge every season. Every season they do this. Wouldn't you be watching the show to prepare? Anyway, look how beautiful this scene is. <laughs> look at this beautiful ass scene right now. Can I change my anything yet? I don't think so. I think I haven't got to a campfire yet. Whenever I get to a fire, I might be able to change my skin and stuff. There's some crazy skins in this one. Oh my god, look at this beautiful ass view. I wonder how much of this is, um... Just images. You know? Like, if is I wonder if that landscape over there is just an image. <laughs> oh my god, just, just snatch these feathers real quick? Can I not snatch the eggs? Those might be good to eat. Yeah. Like, you're fucking kidding me that she would be able to do all this running and jumping after being in a plane crash. All of her organs are pulverized right now. Oh my god, preach! The monkeys are spitting facts right now. Mmm. Nice, nice slippery, sludgy sound that just made. Look at this mud physics! Oh my god, I forgot about this. The physics of the deep mud is crazy. Like, it looks cool and also crazy at the same time. The way my legs are sinking into it. Someone must be around. Hello? Jonah! Hello? Miguel! Can you hear me? Hello? Where are you? Where are you? See, I'm doing a drastically different British accent than she's doing. I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. This is all my fault. I should have listened to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. I hope no one else was hurt. Or the village destroyed. Okay. I need to stop these cataclysms before it's too late. Skill tree! At least this one has a cool design. Um, I have four points. Which one is which? This is... is this sneaky? This is like... resources... Yeah, this is like hunting. Why would I care about that? Sorry, it's gonna take me a second to think about the skills. I have to actually read it. And then what is this stuff? This is obviously violence. This is the violence section. Faster shots I could deal with. That sounds nice. Um. 
Ähm Less fall damage would be nice too. Never slip when grabbing ledges? That like makes the game less fun. Okay, this is stealth kill. I'll do that. Oh, I remember this! You can chain them together! So when there's two of them next to each other, you can stealth kill both of them, like, two in a row. Oh, I remember that. That one's cool. Automatically loot them is like, who cares? Why would I spend skill points on that? Lure traps? I don't really care right now. Breath capacity? I don't really care. Let's do, um, faster shooting, right? Because where's, where's the ones where I can, like, tag people and shoot them? This one. This one. This one. How do I get that one? Okay, I need to go that way. Because I want to start unlocking these. This is the one where you can shoot two at a time. And then... what else? I don't fucking care about the hunting stuff. I don't care about any of this. Um, maybe I'll just save. I'll just save for now. Save my skill points, that is. And I still can't change my skin. It does, like, completely break the fourth wall, which is funny. Because <laughs> you can... You can change to, like... Just a ridiculous outfit. Or they have skins that are, like, how Lara looks in old games. Which, of course, makes no sense at all. Like, she's got less polygons. But it's fun. Part of the plane landed here. My gear is in that cargo. I'll need to cut it down. I'll need to cut it down. Look at those monkeys. Having a field day. I need something to cut that down. Oh, I don't ha I don't even have a knife yet. There was nothing in the- at the camp? Nobody left a knife at the camp? Oh yeah, there's a tomb over here! There's already a tomb! I can't even get boxes without a knife, though. See, this is what I'm saying! In terms of number of tombs, this game does pretty good, okay? I don't even have any of my shit yet. And there's already a tomb I can go in later. Look at this lovely puddle. Yeah, there's tombs and crypts, and crypts are like... extremely mini tombs. The amount of bodies is truly disturbing. Cusco belongs to Hernando Pizarro. Right yeah, it's cool all these documents you find throne. because it's like there'll be the de Almagro has been captured. Um, Orgones is dead. The like monoliths or whatever with uh, the they actual like Mayan or Aztec mountains, legends. And, the and then there'll be all these documents Cusco. you find from to meet us various people Rome. conquesting around Your here, doing cover. exactly what I'm doing, His stealing stuff. Through Gonzalo's infantry charge into disorder. Anyway, I won't- I won't make you guys sit through reading all those, but when I play it, I listen to all of them. Oh, I can't go this way either, because I need my bow. I better focus on getting my stuff. Does that show up on the map too? Yeah. So I can come back to the crypt later. Oh my god, I feel so naked without my tools! I feel as naked as if I'm on Naked and Afraid right now. You could say. I wouldn't survive one millisecond on a survival show. Absolutely no way. Oh, 
I know there's a challenge tomb over there. I can't go in yet. Oh, is this how I get- is this how I get up there? I can't go in there yet though, right? Is it gonna let me go in here already with no stuff? No. <laughs> I need my axe. I don't think I actually have the thing yet. Oh my god, look at this guy lumbering along. Are these capybaras? Look at them fucking lumbering all over the forest. Waddling, lumbering. It's gonna give me that little notification a million times that there's a tomb right there. I saw a little flickering light. Oh, I still can't get it. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm so stupid. Look at the baby! There was a little baby one. Okay, if I was a knife, where would I be? If I was a knife right now, where would I be? Is this a part of the plane I can reach? Can I just grab some scrap metal off of that? I think that's kind of what I'm about to do. I swear I keep hearing beeping, but is that just a forest creature? Don't I just go over here? Yeah. I am just gonna grab some metal off of this. Girl, will you be careful? You're freaking me out. I'm so injured right now. I'm beyond injured. Nobody's ever been as injured as I am right now. I can't go any further this way, right? Am I going in after that? Yeah. Not the eels again! Please! There's no way! I've been through too much! I'm gonna accidentally stab my own arm doing that. No, this girl's been through far too much. There's simply no way a human being could survive this. I'm trying to figure out if there was more stuff down here. Just some kelp. Okay, now we're cutting down the plane. And I think I can- I can finally pick up boxes now. Oh my god, I feel so much better. Good, but it's dull. You need to find something to sharpen These animals are doing too much. Not- I, not I need to sharpen it! This is too much work. Exactly what I was looking for. Just need a bit more. I don't know how finding these little scraps of wood is helping me sharpen my knife, but sure. Maybe it's a skill I have to get to, uh, to roll at the bottom of falls. Hello? Ew! That's the sound of me stepping on a carcass?
Gross. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. Everybody knows you can only sharpen a knife next to a campfire. Oh, because it's telling it's telling me how to upgrade my weapons. Um Yes, craft it. Slay. What else can I do? Oh. Now I can change my skins and I have all this shit unlocked from playing it before. Oh my god, who who am I going to be? It's it's time for a fashion show. I have every outfit. Yes! Oh my god. Should I do this? Is this too much? Is this breaking your guys' immersion? If I'm- if I'm ancient Lara? I like how the only difference here is the jacket. I think I- I played with this one for a while before. This is like a nice middle ground between <laughs> truly ancient Lara and modern. I think these ones with the little symbol are like extra ones that I got from buying stuff or something. Look how swaggy she looks. I'm trying to find, um, there's one of these outfits that I love. Oh my god, the workout gear? We're just pretending that I just found all these outfits on the ground just now, I guess. Where's my favorite one? There's one of these that I would wear so much just because it's so pretty. Maybe I don't have it yet. Which one am I supposed to be wearing? <laughs> no, I don't remember which one I'm supposed to be wearing. Oh no, immersion is broken. Probably this one, right? I look so fucked up in this one. Look at my leg. I'm like bleeding. This is from the first game. No, this is from the 2013 one. My face is different and everything. It's crazy how many outfits they have. No, I, I usually try to pick one that's like matches my environment because I want to be immersed. Oh my god, Slay. Look at that one. No, we're going to play as Angel of Darkness for a minute because I want to and because I said so. <laughs> Look how badass I am! I'm still saving my points. Oh my god. Oh my god, Lara Slay. <laughs> that should be sharp enough. Not my mouth doesn't move at all when I talk. Oh, I look sick though. Oh, I look sick and twisted though. I love this for me. Now we're cutting these ropes down. See, now I feel better because I magically got rid of all my injuries by changing my skin. That's how that works. Are we not instantly having so much more fun with this skin? Yes. Now I can get my gear. Why didn't they bother to animate her mouth? They still could have animated her mouth. The mysterious beeping in the forest is really kind of annoying. Oh, it's fun that like her ancient ponytail, that. they like kind of modernize the physics of it a little bit though. Like the physics of it makes sense. Miss Croft? Anyone? Come in. Miguel? It does look like a Where mod. It looks you? like that I shouldn't be allowed to do this. <laughs> The fact that my mouth doesn't move really sucks. They should have animated my, fa my face still. Just wait till we get to the cutscenes. It's gonna look so fucking stupid in the cutscenes. Um, so first of all... Yeah, I can shoot that, right? 
I think that's just like an extra challenge to shoot all those. That was kind of mean. That was something's nest that I just shot down for no reason. Okay, now we can go back and do things. So I'm gonna go to the tomb. This is Tomb Raider, and I'm gonna go do the tomb. I think I had to go up on that tree first to get over there. Cause can I not just jump up here? No, I can just jump up here. I don't have my axe yet? What do I have? Oh my god, I only have my bow? Good lord, Lara. Where am I supposed to go? God damn. What did I need for the crypt? I needed, um, rope arrows. Do I even have those? No. Oh my god, I can't do anything. I'm useless still. I gotta go find my friends. Why can't I harvest this carcass? <laughs> what is this carcass doing? Can I- can I actually do that? Okay, I do have rope arrows. So can I do the crypt or not? I'm sorry I keep just running back to the same places. <laughs> but can I do the crypt is my question. I think it was a rope arrow. Yes? Yes, it was. So we can't do a tomb, but we can do a crypt. Okay, this is the next best thing. And I'm looking with my eyes for traps. And I'm being so careful and cautious. And I'm gonna have to shimmy my way through these dead bodies. Excuse careful. me! Excuse careful. me! Sorry! Sorry about that. Oh, I'm groping them. I'm groping the bodies, though. I was groping his chest. Sorry about that. Lara loves to push a big switch. This girl loves to push a big switch. These crazy mud physics again. Look at me slogging. Oh my god, I've been doing so much slogging lately. Girl, stop. I almost ran into that one again. I really need to stand farther back when I do that. Thirtieth of May. This morning we entered uncharted territory. Uncharted? Bones of dead <laughs> uncharted? Don't even mention that. Don't even mention that rip off. This is Lara's game. This is me reading. This is me doing what's what's called reading. May a goo be the one. Um, this is something I jump over. This is just the way back, right? Should I keep going? Yeah, because here's the crypt. Excuse me, everybody. I know you're all dead in here. I'm sorry. There is some kind of uh, knowledge I need to obtain. From this coffin. Oh, I got an outfit from that. I got some boots. Can I not go back? Maybe I should have gone back before, because now I can't get up there again. I'm, I'm just gonna slip slide right back down. So that sucks for me. I can only go forward. This skin looks so funny. Oh, damn. 
I need my goddamn axe. Oh, I can get back up. This is me getting up back up right now. So there's something extra in here that I need the axe for, but guess what? I need to stop trying to get all the extra stuff. Because you don't care. Okay, this is for content. This is not for learning. If you want to learn about the Mayans, you can go read about it on Wikipedia. Okay, so this definitely is just the way back. Man, old Lara truly has a body like you've never seen. Like, waist as thin as my head. Oh my god, I really want to go get some kind of beverage, but the cat is on me again. And she's so cute. I can't even complain about it. I look down and see an angel. What am I supposed to do? Should I just play the whole game with this skin? It's so funny. I, I don't think I ever played with it on for very long before because it just completely breaks immersion. But it is very humorous. These guys are just running- look at them! Running into their little hidey holes. I can't even get them in there. Okay, so I got some boots, I guess. That was not very helpful. Where haven't I been? I need to get across. And I just- I just simply can. I just simply can. I don't need anything else. I just simply can do it. Miguel? I don't like this. <laughs> it's gonna kill me when she's trying to be Miguel? dramatic. <laughs> Could it have been to just add the same face animations onto this skin? Miguel? Miguel? Like, why didn't they just do that? Oh, there's hella blood, girl. There's no way this ended well. There's hella blood everywhere. Dude, the glasses are everything. Me, me. <laughs> Slogging through the jungle in these in these fly ass sunglasses? Are you kidding? Um God, there's so much blood. There's truly a tremendous amount of blood. I can harvest this guy. I can't imagine, to be honest, looking at this carcass on the ground, what what I could obtain from this that would be useful to me. But Lara evidently sees something that I'm not seeing there. We're following the trail of blood. Miguel? In case you guys were wondering, I don't think Miguel is okay. I don't think he's gonna be okay. If only you could tell how Lara was feeling right now through her facial expressions. If only you could, but you can't. So this is going to be more like an experience of, uh, like, reading a book. Where you're just having to use your imagination. Sorry about that. That's really grotesque, and I wasn't expecting that. I'm sorry I couldn't warn you how disgusting that was. I did not remember that. That's gross. Um. But yeah, so Miguel became a snack for this leopard is what happened. And Lara is fearless. <laughs> Lara has zero expression. Oh! <laughs> I 
The complete lack of emotions is kind of making me feel like a badass, though. Holy shit. Holy shit is right. That's what I would say in this situation. Um, so I'm sneaking. I'm slogging through the mud again. Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> Lara says what we're all thinking. Oh, to be careful. god. She truly says what we're all thinking and feeling. I am gonna have to fight it, I think. It's not all just sneaking. I think I have to shoot it in its little face. At least as a quick time event or something, I don't remember. It's definite- oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Ah! Ah, this is scary. This is scary. This is what we call scary. Whoa, 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 whoa! It's working. It's really hard to get them in the head for some reason. Shit. Oh my god, I can't see you! <laughs> You're coming from behind! Oh my god. Please. Please. Oh my god. Why do they have so much health? I am tapping B for sure. I am definitely tapping B is what I'm doing. Oh my god, I was doing so good with the human headshots a minute ago. Ah! <laughs> no! Wait, is my arm supposed to be in his mouth? It wasn't quite. The skin was ma meaning my arm was not quite in his mouth. Whoa, my eyes are black. What's happening? Again, no emotion, zero emotion. Is this like a standstill and they don't see you situation? Like a T-Rex? I like how that's something that people say now about T-Rexes and Jurassic Park just made that up. Eyes black, why am I demonic? <sighs> that was a really pathetic fight on my part. Um, I could have done much better than that. I definitely in previous playthroughs of this, have been better at shooting them in the head. Wow, I'm completely out of arrows now. I could have been crafting more the whole time, I guess. Probably should have done that uh, before the jaguar fight. <laughs> Not me miss- I'm missing so much stuff. Whatever. We don't have time for all the lore. That's part of the wreckage. Jonah! Did I hear Jonah on the radio already, or did I hear Miguel? F to Miguel, by the way. R.I.P. to Miguel. <laughs> Sucks to be him. Truly. 
At least he probably had a pretty quick death, right? Because he was torn completely in half. I don't know, how long do you think you stay conscious after being torn in half? Probably longer than you would like. Yeah, I'm getting hella uh, journals from this guy that was expeditioning around here. Wow, look, pretty waterfall. That's actually very beautiful. I don't really know where I'm going. I'm kind of just exploring. No, I think that is where I'm supposed to go. Can I not get, uh, over there? Like, in that cave? Yeah! What's over here? Yeah, I still don't have my axe, but there is a crypt over there. water. Oh, there's more of the plane under there. Not really. Okay. Oh! Just kidding. Secrets revealed. Oh, so this is telling me where, um, there's stuff. That's what we call that. That's- that's telling us where there's stuff. Um, I don't remember what my video card is, but it's a good one. <laughs> it's an NVIDIA one and it's a good one, that's what I remember. I never remember the numbers, but like, when I'm in the process of buying a new computer, I'll like look it up and actually know what they mean and then I forget it as soon as I buy it. I just know I bought a good one. Where am I going? Jonah! Jonah, are you there? I told you she was gonna say that. Jonah! Hell yeah. King. Bestie. Ah. Again, this would be like more impactful maybe if we could see hey, her emotions. You know happened, but we're imagining. We're using our imaginations right now. <laughs> What's wrong with your arm? Jonah's got a worm. Sort of That's what we call a worm. That's nasty. <laughs> she looks so happy. She's so happy. If we leave it in there, alone and get worse. We're gonna cut the worm out of Jonah. So if you don't want to see that, look away. I don't. I don't remember if they show it. You sure, you know what you're doing. Uh, <laughs> I had something similar happen to me when I was a child in Egypt. I won't lie, it's gonna hurt. Girl, did you sterilize that arrowhead? You think that storm from earlier was? She's going in raw with a dirty arrowhead. He's gonna get tetanus. I don't know. Ugh. Uh, I think maybe we should stop He's getting 20 stock. diseases right now. We've been pushing so hard forward. <laughs> Flying into that storm. I didn't think it was gonna be that bad. I... Well, I should have insisted we turn back. I mean, I get it. You lock onto a problem and... How is he having a conversation while she's doing this? There's no way. Jonah. I would be I screaming. I'm with you. If I was either- <laughs> If I was either one of them, I'd be screaming. <laughs> if if I was cutting the worm or having the worm cut, I would be screaming. From doing what they want. You 
You guys, I wish I had a cat cam because she's being Sometimes very adorable I right now. Like I have to keep going, and if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. But maybe for the sake of she's so lives, real for that. We could have turned back. <laughs> I get it, Lara. I really do. Ew! Look at that worm. You should give him a name. Okay. Eli. No, my cousin. He's always trying to get under my skin. Ha 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 ha. Goodbye, Eli. Ha 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 Thanks. Right, does anyone have hand sanitizer? Did they have any in the plane? We should go. If we can find That Carl. probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Sounds good. Oh, nasty. We've both got such disgusting, <laughs> grotesque <laughs> wounds. If there's one thing about the two of us I'm right now, we've got some grotesque stuff. wounds. Yeah, I think Miguel was heading toward it when... Okay, I have my axe How now. How did you manage to get Eli in your arm anyway? Uh, I was trying to figure out if the water was clean. Got my answer. <laughs> Do you really believe in all that? That's okay. Here's the thing. We can go back and do the tomb right now, or we can come back later. We're just gonna do it right now, right? Why wouldn't we? So because when we go through here, we're moving on with the story. I believe that if it is true, it's important enough to die for. Or for Trinity to kill for. So this is really about revenge. Oh, no, do I have to do it? No, I, I don't know. It's not letting me use I the campfire. The Maybe I have to do this right now. But we definitely can come back, so don't worry. Don't it's worry. Good. I know you guys are worried. Get through here. Give me a hand. <sighs> we'll be able to come back and do it. There's just very conveniently a town right next to us that we're going to. We have to get down there. You sure this is a path? Come on, stay close to me. Look how hot I am this though in my little crop top and my short shorts. I'm looking hot AF in this jungle. <sighs> oh. Oh. Almost there. Jonah is me in this situation. Hang on to the vine. There's so many vines on the wall you could be hanging on to. Oh, God. You're right. I'm okay. Just go, I'm just keep fast. going, just do it fast. Okay. You're right. I, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. What do you think built all this? It could have been the Inca. Look at these devices. Look at these mysterious dogs. devices in the ground. Look at me reading again? Deciphering symbols? Me too. What was the first, like, what created this trope of, like, Tomb Raider and Indiana Jones? What was the first one? I bet this one was <laughs> You wanna try it? Uh, I think I'll stick with the bottles you found in the cargo from the plane. Like, was there something b before Indiana Jones? Oh, I vaguely remember this puzzle. We have to, like, extend this bridge somehow. Joan is talking to me and I cannot hear him. <laughs> Wasn't your thing. Um, okay, we have to lift that up with that pulley. This is just a thing I'm digging up. Is 
That cage lifts up too, I guess. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Does boarding school count? <laughs> I don't know. Does it? <laughs> Probably Look not. at us having light-hearted conversation in a dire moment. Anyway. Look at us comforting each other with comedic relief. It's not very realistic, though. I don't know that I would be uh, talking and laughing in this situation. Okay. There's water flowing over there now. With Eli gone, your arm should heal quickly. Yeah. I feel a lot better already. I'm like balancing on a balance beam and talking to him at the same time. Slay. Okay. It's too heavy. Give me a hand. The water's filling the bucket. Good. Let's see what those counterweights do. He has to hold it up the whole time? Ugh, the bucket's leaking. Hold on back. We'll try again. Okay. Okay. No, wait. I'm going down. It's gonna fall back down. It's gonna fall back down. I need to attach the rope. Right? Maybe it's the opposite. Maybe it goes down when we do that? Yeah, it goes down. Now I attach it. To the bridge. Okay, Jonah. You can let go. And when it goes back up, the bridge will come up. Um, truly the most convoluted bridge design I've ever seen in my life. Why would they do it like that? Lara, jump! I know both your legs are broken, but you're gonna have to jump. Guess we go through here. After you. <laughs> I'm kind of getting used to the skin now, and it doesn't seem What's weird that? anymore. I think it's some sort of sealer or. Help me with this. Sure. What is it? It's a recipe. I love how recklessly Seems I just go around pushing herbs. mysterious ancient buttons and switches and levers. I do not care. Jaguars. I don't even think so about what goes. it's going to do before I do it. We are just over here. Yeah, so those big golden things, I think, give me, like, crazy new skills. Um, that was- sorry, that was a little message telling me I can do drugs if I want to see the animals better. I don't really care about that, though. We're getting closer to the village. I can't wait to get back to civilization. It really wants me to do the drugs, though. These are different from the ruins in Mexico. Oh, more carcasses. I guess I should collect it, right? No, I mean there is supposed to be a because it's giving me leather. Peru, Paititi. Every treasure hunter on Earth is looking for it. But Dad's not Bye, stopping Kiki. Mexico. Like he lost interest. I have a feeling we're gonna find it. 
Something tells me we're gonna find it. Passageway. That's promising. Remind me how the riddle goes again. She's the heart of the serpent. To the silver-crowned mountain where the twins confer. Oh, is this a tomb right here? Do you think it is squat, Yaku? Assuming we're going. I forgot about this. There's a tomb right here, and we just leave Jonah. We just leave Jonah to go to a tomb real quick. Like, we just stopped mid-conversation. He's like starving, we're injured. He's desperate to get to civilization to like get some food and rest. And I'm like, sorry, there's a tomb here. Excuse me while I raid this tomb. She was really fucking struggling through that cre crevice, through that crevasse. She was struggling for her life. Oh my god, first tomb! How long have I been streaming? Two and a half hours I've been streaming, we just got to our first tomb. Guys, am I lagging like crazy? God, I hate that. My stream- I'm back now, but my stream never used to lag. And every once in a while it just lags like crazy and then comes back. I appreciate it. you guys buying the shirts! I'm gonna cry! I wasn't expecting to sell anything! <laughs> I was like, I just wanna make some stupid t-shirts for fun. Genuinely, did not expect to get any orders today, but it makes me happy. I'm glad. Um, up? Oh, no. This is so exciting. Tomb. Ah. I almost run into those ropes every single time. It's lagging again. It's red again. I'm sorry, I don't know what to do about that. I guess I'll see if it like... If it keeps happening. I don't know what to do about it though. Because if it's just my internet, there's not much I can do about it. Um... Down. Oh no, this is a down and swing. This is a down and swing. Yeah, I'm just gonna go into get it done mode and stop worrying about getting all the extras because that's not really what this playthrough is about i just want to do all the puzzles again really oh my god i don't even have a map in here i'm on my own look at this lovely little camp so this is some of the people that were conquesting right these are like some... some Spanish conquesters. Fucking all the natives up. Looks like they got what they deserved. It wouldn't have any- the lag wouldn't have anything to do with the loading, because it's a different computer that I'm streaming on. Because I'm streaming from, uh, my laptop. Which is a very good laptop, like, the laptop is not the problem, I think it's my internet. Because I've noticed that sometimes when I do a speed test, it'll just randomly be slower, but like, normally I have extremely fast internet, even for uploads. But I think it just kind of cuts out for like a few seconds randomly, which is really annoying. 
and like wouldn't really affect anything but streaming but it is annoying for streaming where do i go Am I dumb? Maybe I shouldn't have put the exploration on hard. <laughs> Which way am I going? Oh, right there, right there. I need to use my eyes more. I got it, I got it, I figured it out. Whoa! I pushed the button, you guys. I swear to god you can probably hear in the mic me pushing the button and it doesn't work. There's still scary noises going on. This gear is early 20th century. Anyway, as you may have heard, there's some crazy zombie noises going on. Because there are, in fact some crazy zombies around here. You know what? I don't have to hold it down, do I? It wasn't telling me to hold it down, was it? <laughs> How many times am I gonna fall off this wall? Lara, please don't just straight up jump off of it, okay? This is ruining my reputation. My reputation is in shambles. No, I got it that time. The zombies are going wacko mode up there. Like, you see how far I'm going away from Jonah? He's waiting for me! Girl, where are you going? Um, do I want to change my bow? I don't think so. I think I pretty much always just use the regular one and upgrade it. Um, so what do we want to do? Yeah, this is what I need the leather for, is upgrading. Draw speed, hold time. I don't care about that, I want damage. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do we have another skill point yet? Yeah. Um, I feel like I want to just go... Okay, I do want the double stealth takedown. But I also feel like I want to just go as fast as possible to, uh... The automatic headshot thing. So do I have to get this first? What is this? Whatever it is, it's what I needed to get this. Yeah, we're just gonna go straight to the double headshot thing because that is cool. And everything I do is in order to be cool. And now we're gonna shimmy through this crack. Is someone there? And then I look at this- at this guy. Is someone there? This guy's here. I don't know if that's who you're looking for. I don't think there's anything going on in here. I just need to get out somehow. Look at all these beautiful murals on the walls. Well, guess I'm stuck. Guess I live here now.
Whoa! What'd you say? Girl, the music's swelling. Drowned out your voice. I didn't hear what you said. Look at this beautiful sight. This game, you guys. This is Minecraft. I can mine gold. Why is that so funny? I came across a fucking gold vein and I mined it as Lara Croft. <laughs> okay. Oh, I haven't grappled yet. I forgot that's what that was for. See, like, at least, you know, when I was complaining about Horizon Zero Dawn, everything you could use was just yellow, right? It was, like, so unnatural. This is, like, the white kind of guides you, and there's less white going on now because I have it on hard. But, like, they just put some little white flowers on it. And it's still, like, very obvious once you're used to what to look for. But it's at least, there's an explanation, like, it's flowers. Again, here's me probably making excuses. But, like, it, at, at least they made it clear, you know? I, they found a way to make it clear, and it doesn't look completely fucking stupid. Yeah, I'm gonna start- I'm gonna start smelting it. Oh, there's hella swag in here. I just obtained so much swag and I'm not reading any of it. Cause I'm on a mission. Oh my god, see? There's- there's guys sneaking around in here. There's crazy zombie guys sneaking around. Whispering in the trees. Again, it's always so insane to me that all these mechanisms work. Like, this is just rope. Rope would simply disintegrate. Over literal thousands of years? Rope would not survive in all these pulley systems. And obviously it's fine, because we're suspending disbelief. But it's just funny, this stuff is made of rope and twigs, and, it, and you're telling me it's still here? <laughs> they must have abandoned this place in the middle of building it. Look at that pit. I'm not finna be in the pit today. Let me tell you, I'm not planning to be on the, in that pit. Before I end the stream, I have to show the finna pee in the- Finna pee in the pit? Finna be in the pit. I have to show that TikTok. Cause I guarantee none of you know what I'm talking about, but it's funny to me. Okay, what does this enormous lever do? Whoa! Like, it's completely insane that all this stuff would still be here. Am I jumping on that? I feel like I should jump on that. And then it's gonna go back, right? Is it gonna go back? 
Or do I have to push it back and then jump? Run! Ah! Uh, no, there's no way, it's not... <laughs> it's too fast. I have to make it stay. Wait. There's a rope thingy on it, I can make it stay somehow. I don't really understand why pulling this lever in the same direction switches the direction of this thing. But we're choosing not to worry about it. Um, what can I stick that to? Over there? Do I move this? <laughs> I'm a little bit confused because how am I going to get back? That should hold. Oh, like this. Exactly like this actually is how I'm going to get back. So now I'm going to move this and that's going to stay for a little bit longer. Um, if you go ahead and pull it, it's gonna stay for long enough for me to jump on it. Made it. Slay. I love how she just does shit like this with absolutely no thought as to how she's gonna get back. She has no regard for her own life at all. Um, but I saw the end of the tomb right there. It's right under that guy's face because it's that gold thing. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with gold. That's like the subplot of this game, I guess, is that I'm obsessed with gold. I don't remember if I actually have to kill any of those zombie guys right now. Under the watchful eye of one of the Lords of Death lies the gate to Shabalba, where all must travel when transitioning from this life to the next. Mm hmm. Oh, maybe I'm jumping. Am I jumping this way? Oh my god, that's. Absolutely minuscule ledge I just jumped onto. Those zombies are making crazy sounds. Whoa! They are trying to get rid of me! More gold! Literally, I'm obsessed! Oh, I just climb faster? That's it? Well, I can climb faster now. We've done a tomb, we did it. <laughs> I was gonna be in the pit. Oh my god. Okay, that's it, right? I'm sorry, I keep looking around. I'm so used to- The way I play games, naturally, is not conducive to making content because I just stare at things for so long. Like, I take everything so slow. And I have to remind myself when I'm streaming that like- Oh, I was supposed to grapple! <laughs> I have to remind myself when I'm streaming that like, I have to keep going. I can't just like, stare at nothing for 30 seconds.
Okay, grapple this time, girl. You got it. I'm trying to figure out when I get the thing where if I roll at the bottom of a fall, I don't take fall damage. Because that's like a core part of my playing strategy. Is being able to jump off of very large cliffs. This is so fun, I love this game. And I know I need to stream more, uh, uh, Skyward Sword. Because I do want to finish it one day. In another year, I want to finish that game. Oh my god, I'm scared! But this is so fun now, I kind of just want to stream this forever. Okay, I'm just going back now, I think. And maybe there were extra things, but I don't care because I'm speedrunning and I need to remember to speedrun. That was a sk- was that a skull on the ground I was kicking around casually? That's a skull, girl. And I'm kicking it around like a rock. Now I can finally come back out of this hole. If you'll remember, our friend Jonah has been waiting for us for an hour. We said, sorry, I had to go collect some gold. I had to go pick up some gold from this tomb and also mine some gold directly from the, the veins in the rocks with my pickaxe. Jonah's like, girl, I'm starving and I just got a worm cut out of my arm. Could we please like go to a hotel and rest Another for a second? Of those Maya altars and and what? And I'm An like, camp I had to go to get the, I had to go get gold. It's such a real right. At least Jonah didn't ask what happened. The no, I still don't have enough. Where am I going? North. Look at him waiting for me. Okay, we're gonna get to the town, and and I'll have to I have to stop and go to bed. Jonah, help me with this. On three. <laughs> I had two, to look at that skull, one. dude. It was interesting. It was rolling on the ground. Ooh. Oh my god! Oh my god! Have I not been through enough? Holy shit, have I not been through enough? I like how I don't shoot it. I pass it to her. Oh. I fully put the controller down during that cutscene and I had to pick it up again. Fuck you. Oh my god. I pushed B. I pushed B. I shot him right in his fucking head. And I still didn't kill him. They take multiple headshots. Oh my god, I forgot I can get in the tree. I aim! Oh my god. This is so tragic, you guys. I'm not this bad. These guys are so much harder to kill than humans. How many arrows do I have to put in him? I swear. The jaguars suck. Laura, are you okay? Are you okay? Oh my god, the jaguars suck. Your back looks bad. I'm gonna go make camp. I 
What do you mean make camp? I thought we were about to get to the town. We can see it! It's right there! <laughs> Sorry, we're gonna have another emotional moment. Let me take a look at that. Again, I would not just be complaining about my back. I was in a plane crash. My bruised. whole body would be bruised. I would not be able to walk. You know, with everything we've been through recently, I've been thinking about my brother. I always try to protect him from my father, from himself. But I lost him. Jonah's thinking about his past, which again, I personally wouldn't be doing right now. I think we've got enough going on in the present right place, to be thinking about the past. The right What's on my chest? Is that a little light? Is that a little GoPro? Is Lara filming with a little GoPro on her chest? Again, we can't even see the wound because I have this skin on. We can't even see- there's supposed to be a big gash on my back from the jaguar. Thank you, Rad Dan. Have a have a good night. I know. Oh, the boobies are boobing though. My parents. The firelight gleaming on my <laughs> fashionable glasses. I had a dream about my mother recently. <laughs> Look at <laughs> she's talking about her parents. <laughs> It's giving Toy Story. Used to keep from me. It's giving action figure talking. Hide things. About her especially. Why would he do that? Oh, oh my god, I love getting people into Genshin. It didn't stop me from looking for them, of course. <laughs> That's Loki my mission as a human on Earth. Is to get everyone into Genshin. In hindsight, it was pretty funny in my video today that I spent like five minutes at the end talking about Genshin while playing a completely different video game. Domingo it's just my life. Use the silver box of Ishel to remake the world. If you had that power, I probably should have put captions on so you could tell what they're saying when I'm talking over them all the time. <laughs> probably. You wouldn't go back to when your brother was alive and be with him again. Um, and lose everything else. No way. I like this world. It's... It's not perfect. But everything I love now is in it. He said everything I love is in it, and he looked at Lara. I don't know if they're even supposed to be romantic interests. Probably not, but they just have a cute friendship. Oh, I totally forgot. Game. There's this whole um, the flashback and sequence. Okay, when this cutscene's over, we have to stop, though. In a minute, Dad. Oh my god, I get to spend some time as a child in my mansion. I forgot. Look at this rich, rich ass child. Oh my god, spoiled rich ass child. Okay. We're saving? Um, we're saving in game two? Okay, we're not gonna override my 88% save. 
We're gonna save in the other one. Okay. Oh my god, now you can see the cat. Now we can get the cat cam. Oh my gosh, baby. She's so pathetic. Oh no. She's been snoozing on me. You have anything to say? <laughs> you have anything to say? She's mad because I woke her up. I should get a cat cam going. I usually, um, not usually, but a while ago I set up to have another camera and I couldn't use it today because, um, oh, thank you for the little donation. I couldn't set up my other camera today because one of my USB ports on my laptop is broken. What a thrilling story. But I was sad about it because I'm supposed to have another camera. So hopefully I get that fixed eventually and, and then I can have a little multi-cam set up. Um, this is so cute. She's so sleepy. Little baby. Um, okay. I'm gonna go to bed. This has been a lovely stream. I love this game. I should stream this more. This is so fun. I like to stream a game I'm actually good at. You know, it makes me feel smart. Um. Oh, please don't step on the keyboard, girl. You can't be over there. She's gonna end the stream prematurely. Okay. Um. So that's all. I hope you all have a good night. Thank you so much for being here. And, um, yeah, that's all. I'll see you next time. Bye.